I did a pour over and we got a panini and this quiche. We're at this fancy uh, Foxtails gravity bar. It's right by our doctor. We have my pre surgery appointment today, so we are treating ourselves to breakfast beforehand. Well, look at that. It looks super good. And this is a fancy, fancy coffee they roasted in house. So I'm gonna get, I'm gonna dive into this. Okay, stop one, done. We've got our stuff ready for our doctor set. Now we have to go to the hospital to do pre-surgery, like Testing. blood work and physical and yeah. stuff like that. So it's pretty straightforward. We just had to get, you know, legality stuff done. Yeah. I just had to sign basically everything with yeah, it. Sign her life away and, and everything. Cause she's gonna go under for an, like an hour or two. Yeah. Thursday morning, but it was nice. It was, you know, the people here at our office are always super, super nice. Mm -hmm. um, if you're in the Orlando area, let us know if you need a doctor like that. Yeah. We'd we, love to share it. He's awesome. Half of like, I mean, we just feel so, like obviously we, we wanted to move down here for other reasons, but the fact that we found such an awesome doctor just is Pointing cherry us, on top. Yeah, knows that we're doing the right thing. Yeah. But now we have to go to the hospital to do more tests. Yes. All right, we're in the parking garage of Florida Hospital, but we're getting ready to leave. Got ourselves, I was so happy that they gave us a parking pass. Cool. Um, Look it. Sarah had to give some blood. It was pretty straightforward. We thought she was going to have to get an EKG for some reason, like the doctor previously said it, but she didn't. Everything's all set. Like, we're ready to go. Um, we got to be here 6 a.m. on Thursday to yeah. get up even earlier. So it's going to be an interesting get ready. week. Yeah, it'll we're be interesting. We're going to try week. and, you know, we're still going to put out a video every day. Yeah, we're going to put videos just give us, you know, I know you guys are going to be understanding about when the videos go up. Yeah. Like, for instance, today, is. and what the kind of, like, today it's 2 o'clock right now, our video from yesterday still hasn't gone up, but, um, that is what it is, and we know you guys are going to be understanding, so thank you, and all the support as well, but, yeah. next thing on the to-do list is to be back here at 6 a.m., and we'll probably end up leaving <laughs> Thursday night, as all goes well, Girl. we'll leave Thursday afternoon, you know, surgery's at 8, about an hour surgery, then she's got to come off anesthesia and do like outpatient stuff before she's okay to go. So we'll probably leave in the early afternoon. Yeah. Thursday. And our plan for when when I um, am recovering, we're gonna watch all the seasons of Boy Meets World. We have yeah. them on DVD. Because so. I already talked to my work, I'm gonna be off Thursday and Friday. Um, and she should be fine by Monday. But I could always, yeah. my work super understanding. I can always work from home or something on Monday if I if need be. Let's go, I'm like, excited. start our day now. Yeah. yeah it's finally, like, I just can't wait for Thursday now because she's actually never been in surgery before, like, right. where she has gone under. I had a back surgery in high school. I've got rods in my back. Um, it's almost 10 years. Yeah, it's almost been 10 years since my surgery. Yeah. Um, but it's just exciting to finally, like, actually take steps. Yeah. Towards what we're trying to achieve. Because right. we did before, like, maybe a year, a little over a year ago. We were on some medicines and stuff, but that was back before they knew what was going on. So yeah. it's nice to finally have some answers and then have some action. Right. Because for so long you hear, like, there's no reason why you shouldn't be pregnant. And yeah. So to finally hear and, like, have something to actually do about it, it feels really good. So. We might be going to Disney Springs. Yeah. Let's go. All right. So we're at Disney Springs. And because we have to go see our family friends perform, but we stopped by the PO box and got some awesome mail. We got a Valentine from the Magic Geekdom. We're gonna we'll send. We'll link their channel. Above. We'll link their channel above, and then we're gonna send them. They're gonna be getting a message from us shortly. But then we got from some of our viewers in the Boston area sent us this yeah. amazing package. Marion and Elaine. Yes, thank you so much. This couldn't have come at like literally, like even though today was a good day with like getting stuff ready for the the procedure, it's still like. It's yeah, still scary, so it's, it's still taxing. Morale. Yes. And, and so this came at the perfect time. Yeah. Like I opened this up, I already ate mine. I'm gonna eat that one, that's mine. So good. This giant traditional peanut butter cup. This awesome Boston lapel pin. I know we've mentioned wanting to go to Boston for a long time where it's gonna happen. The most wonderful thing that they got us was, where is it? This St. Gerard, Gerard medal, medal and prayer. So for any 
Catholics who don't know or anybody who's not Catholic, St. Gerard is the patron saint of fertility. Yeah. And, and so that means a lot to us. Thank you so much. Yeah. You know, at the end of the day, regardless of like people's religious beliefs, we are good people and we try to be good people. Yeah. And then to us, that's what's yeah, most like, important. Really super awesome metal, super There's awesome gift. Shop at Disney Springs. Yeah, let's go. go we have some. At, um, yeah. We, our friends don't actually perform for two hours, but we figured by the time we like got home, got settled in, Eve would be too excited and we'd have to like get ready to go. So we're like, let's just go straight to Disney Springs. We haven't been here during the daytime in a long time. So like, let's go enjoy it for a little bit and then we'll go back home afterwards and probably and be home for the rest of the evening. Cause we still have to edit the vlog and cook dinner and play with the dog. I have a little bit of work to do, so. You've got design work. Yeah, just wanted to show you this and. Let's go have some fun. All right, so I think this opened up last week, right? Yeah. It was opened up last week. The Disney corner, we're right across from the polite pig and the green or the lime parking garage. This is bigger than I expected. I this is huge. We're gonna go check this Disney corner out. Super cool. Super cool. You want a chance We got the lowdown from a cast member. So it is just a temporary space for the women's and children's department while the world of Disney is being reimagined. Yeah, so if you weren't aware, they're doing a big overhaul of how World of Disney looks. It's gonna be like a, I call it like a sterile look. It's gonna be like very modern. Look up um, New York, New York City, like Times Square's Disney store. They did like a portion where they were gonna like showcase what else we want. Like it's very white, clean, modern. Yeah. And so they're doing that. So in the meantime, while they have giant sections of World of Disney fenced off, they're bringing that merchandise temporarily over to Disney yeah. Corner. So I thought it was gonna be a brand new store with new merchandise. It's just temporary homes. Business. So that was not what I expected, but still different and cool. Cute little artwork on the walls and such. Yeah. So. We were here just like a week ago and this wall was not up, but this is the center of Walt Disney. That's like a construction line. You can hear it. What do they do? They're making magic in there. But it's like down the whole center. It's kind of weird. Space is the place. There's like the old villain's room. But once again, there's a wall. Wall. Over there, wall. Oh. A bunch of rose gold ears, so World of Disney split down the middle. I wonder if the opposite side is open and it's just the center. Let's go see. All right, here we are. This this is like the the main and main middle entrance to Disney Springs with this wallpaper covering all the doors, and it is the whole thing. I thought it was going to be just the middle section, but here you can see there's this big old wall covering the door. This wall is covering all the whole distance. I wonder if they're gonna change the outside at all. I hope Stitch doesn't leave. Stitch, you haven't spat on people in like months. But over there is here's where our friend's gonna be performing the choir and band that we're here to see at 4:45. Performer, we're about to go get our spot. Please welcome the Amos Alonzo Stag High School Choir. Weekend shenanigans. We had a full weekend. It was a very busy weekend. We have a short we gotta, week. Yeah. We gotta get go home and get some work done. The vlog stuff to get put up. Yeah. Got to <sighs> Eve. 
I'll just relax the rest of the night. This is a rare glimpse into the closet of Sarah and Peter Brookhart. All this right here is donation. This, you should have, we should have done before and after because I am astonished. I left the room for like 30 minutes and Sarah got rid of all these dresses. And this was my section here, but it was absolutely full. And now I'm down to like these five shirts and then whatever's in the dryer. Got my, my ties down. I think I'm keeping the hat collection at that size for now. Let's not overstep our boundaries today. But man, and we're not even done yet. Sarah's filling another bag and we have laundry that we're cleaning to see if we're going to keep any of that. Super good, but let's hold this shirt up. <laughs> this shirt, can you hold that side, please? This shirt right here. <laughs> Big Texan. This is when I tried eating a 72 ounce steak and I couldn't do it. Big Texan, Amarillo, Texas, 72 ounce steak. Tried eating it. I got what, 50, I got 60 something or 56? 57? 50, I think it was 57. I think I got 57 yeah, I was... ounces down of the 72 plus eight the shrimp cocktail the loaf of bread the salad yeah if you ate the whole thing it was free but if you didn't it was 72 dollars dollar an ounce <laughs> and i was on a stage and this big italian family was like cheering me on they couldn't speak almost any english they asked me the next like they the next day they're like did you finish did you finish and i was like no and they were like no all right i said i had a mug of addiction slash problem and here's here's proof of it I want to say this is probably about 80% of them. I have some in the cabinet that we're keeping, and I know I've got another box or two somewhere in the storage, but, like, there's some good ones. Like, look at this Nemo and Bruce set. This Walt Disney World. Castle 1971, super nice one. Brave. Americana. Goofy. This is a solid one. So like these right here we're gonna keep. These we're gonna give away in different form or fashions. Um, but I think like, they're, they're gonna change. Like there's a lot and I don't wanna deal with like getting into all of them right now. So I'm gonna do different ways like giveaways. We're gonna do, I'm gonna randomly place some of them in the parks. So make sure you follow us on Instagram, Twitter and on, the, on these videos cause you'll see where they're going to be dropped. I'll either be like, hey, tomorrow's Saturday, or Friday, it's Fantastic Friday, I'm going to put this brave one somewhere on Hollywood Boulevard, kind of a thing. Kind of like that. But to kick it off, I'm going to give away this Pinocchio. Now, just be warned, you can't microwave this or dish, it's not dishwasher safe because this was attached post-production. It wasn't like baked with that as attached. So that is the reason why you can't microwave. Give the video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below. And leave a comment down below, any comment, but I'd prefer you tell me how and where I should drop these in the parks or resorts. But that's how, that'll give you the entry for this. And I'll run that for, you know, tomorrow's Tuesday. I'll run it until Friday. I'll decide who the winner is Friday while Sarah's recovering from the surgery. So if you want the Pinocchio mug, leave a comment down below. Well, this was a long weekend, and I don't even think we're going to bed too late. It's just after midnight. Yeah. But we've night. been home all night. We were very productive. I did not expect to be this productive tonight. Alrighty. Thank you for following along uh, our long weekend. Mm -hmm. Get ready for some interesting vlogs coming forward with the surgery coming up later this week. This week. But something to look forward to is down in Victoria, get here Sunday. So once I've recovered, it's like, go, go, right go. Back in. Yeah. Alrighty. It's, it's good, good to, be, to home. be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>